Uh, favorite tight end from this Super Bowl? What's that? Uh, the favorite tight end from this Super Bowl. Do you, do you want? The tight end for? Yeah, for the Super Bowl. Oh, my favorite tight end? Oh, oh, other than myself. Okay, well, other than myself, oh, man, right here. Yeah, yeah, I know. I was gonna pick myself. You know, my favorite tight end currently playing right now. I would say, you know, Kelson Kittle are, are the two best tight ends in the league. But my favorite, I'll go with Kittle. I mean, he reminds me of myself. And you know, whenever he gets the ball, he doesn't want to go down. He just wants to be tackled by the whole defense. I mean, you're not just taking him down. You know, I mean, one guy can take him down if they get a clean shot um, at his legs or something. But if if you don't have a clean shot at Kittle. Uh, you're going to have to, you know, bring the whole squad uh, to take him down. And that, that's what it's all about. And, that, you know, he reminds me of myself in that way. So I love watching his game. Rob, Tony, Tony Gonzalez said earlier that he wishes he had the same spotlight on him than Kelsey and Kittle have today. Do you, do you feel that you had enough of that spotlight on on you, oh, on the yeah. tight position back when you played, yes. or does it make you want to come back and play again? <laughs> no, I feel like I've had a tremendous amount of spotlight. I don't need that, you know, I'm not looking for any more. I had tons of it while playing, uh, and it, it was fantastic. It brought awareness in, in many great ways uh, to the tight end position, which is great. And now it's, it's unbelievable to see the spotlight, you know, pass on to Kelson Kittle. And it just shows how important, how great the tight end position really is, you know? I feel like back in the day, it was like, oh, he's a tight end or whatever. Oh, they block or like, or, you know, oh, he can't play or he's just another lineman like back in the day. But now it's transcending, man. You you got to have a tight end to have a great offense, I feel like. You got to have, you know, in, in it, yeah, with good hands that that's, a, that's willing to go in there and get dirty in the trenches too. You don't have to be the best blocker at tight end to make an impact in the – in the run game, you just have to be willing to and, and willing to get dirty in, in the trenches, and that's what it's all about. And you see these tight ends nowadays, like Kill and Kels, you know, bringing that to the to the game and bringing that to the offense, and it's bringing such a spotlight to the tight end position now, and it's great to see that. How do you What's up, sports fans? Breon Page here with Fanatics View. Thank you so much for hanging out with us. If you enjoyed watching and you want to see more content, subscribe down below.